It's awesome. I mean, it's been a crazy 24 hours here, but uh, I'm so happy to be uh, in the spot right now. Um, they got a great thing going here. A lot of, I mean, I met the guys. Seems like an awesome group. Coaches are, are great, and um, I just, you know, love the way these guys play. I've always admired the way they've, you know, skill and compete and, and toughness and all that. And um, I think it'd be a good fit for me. So I'm just happy, happy to be a Panther. If you had to give, I guess, the the short scouting report on on yourself, what would you say you, you bring to the ice every night? Um, yeah, I think I'm a you know 200 foot defenseman who can break the puck out and. Um, I'm pretty simple. I get it and I give it to my forwards. And uh, but I think the biggest thing is I, I compete and I play with a little bit of an edge. Um, like to, you know, kind of get in other guys' faces and, and play hard and um, throw the body around a little bit. Um, but yeah, but it's a 200 foot kind of simple player. And um, hopefully I uh, fit in with these guys well. Special to have the the family ties as well. I know with with Matthew here and yeah. obviously with with your your dad being a, a Panther in the early days. Yeah. Uh, is it fun to throw on the the Panthers uniform for that reason too? Yeah, it was so cool. Just even putting the practice jersey on, looking down was special. I mean, I, I was born in Florida. You know, that's um, where I started off, and um, my dad was obviously here, and it, you know, it just holds a special place in my heart. Um, and being with Matthew is just you know cherry on top. Got family down here and stuff like that is awesome. And Whitey too. I played. I've known Whitey since I was in elementary school. We played going way back. Played at BC together. Um, so yeah, it's a lot of close ties here, and uh, I'm really excited to get going. What did your dad tell you after the news broke yesterday? Um, he told me he thought he was the first one to tell me. He, he's got all excited about it, but um, he he basically called me and just told me how proud he was of me and um, how it's full circle. My mom was, you know, I think a little more emotional about it. Just because she spent, um, you know, the beginning career of my dad's um, career here, and uh, like I said, holds a special place for her. And so um, she was super emotional and um, really happy for me. So um, yeah, it was cool. Obviously, when you look on Hockey DB, it says you're from Mass, but where were you, you were born in Florida? Yeah, Boca. You were born in Boca. Yeah. Right? So do you know how, long, how much time you spent in Florida before you guys moved? Um, so my dad was on the born in '97. That the first year was '93, '94. '93, '94. So he was he was here for that. And then I think I was here for three years, maybe mm -hmm. two years, and then I was gone. Um, I think. Don't quote me on that. <laughs> but then my dad was off to Nashville. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, we, my me and my older brother was born here too. So um, we haven't been back in a while. But it, it'll, it'll be cool to you know come full circle now and, and, and go and um, you know, see what it's like down there. Obviously, you're joining the team here right now on this trip. But how excited are you to get back to Florida for that? Just yeah, see, check it all out. I really. was packing yesterday. I was like, I don't have any shorts. I, I had no <laughs> shorts in my in my bag. I've had all like. Massive hoodies and North Face jackets, so I gotta I gotta throw those all out now and um, go buy some T-shirts. So I'm excited. You mentioned packing. Just how would you describe the last 24 hours from finding out the news and flying here to Vegas? Yeah, uh, it was it was pretty crazy. I mean, the the deadline was at two, and I found out pretty close to then. So um, the, my flight was like a couple hours later. So I just threw some stuff together as much as I could, and um, hopped on a flight to Detroit, Detroit to here. Um, so like I said, it's been it's been a crazy 24 hours, but um, you know I'm I'm super excited to be here and like just getting to know these guys already. It seems like it's going to be a really good fit. Over the last few years, Florida has been really good at finding you know sometimes under the radar defensemen like Gustav Forsling, Josh Maher, Brandon Montour, and really blossoming them, blossoming them into like you know stars yeah. or kind of bringing their game together. How excited are you for the opportunity not to just play with some of these guys, but just be with the organization because of that? No, exactly, and that's something I've definitely uh, picked up on and noticed is how well they've done. Um, you know, developing guys and, and, and getting them to play their game. And, um, you know, I, like I said, I think it's going to be a really good fit. Um, it wasn't really working out in Buffalo. I mean, I, I owe everything to that organization. They've done, you know, got me to where I am today um, from coaches and everything. But I think just the, the new fresh start here, um, I think would be great for me. And uh, I think just the way I play really fits fits this mold. What was Colin, I'm sorry, what was Colin and Matthew's reaction when they found out, did they call you right away? or what Yeah, no, they text? texted me right away. I think they found out uh, getting the band back together. Whitey said, uh, you know, we go way back. We played uh, NTDP out in uh, junior junior hockey together. Um, I lived with Whitey there for a couple of years and went to BC with him. Um, so yeah, we go way back. So it's, it's cool cool to you know see him and Matthew again and kind of uh, relive, uh, relive the old times. How's it being on the ice today with the guys? You know, obviously hectic 24 hours, but you know, just snapping the pucks with them today. It's good. Yeah, it was great. I mean, obviously, uh, it felt good to have the new threads on and, and looking down and seeing um, the red and blue is, 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 is super cool. Uh, but just getting out there and getting my, my plain legs out of the way was what I needed. So it was, it was good. It was a good skate. Thank you, guys. Thanks. Thanks. Thank you. Nice to meet you.